Hey guys, welcome back to another video. My name is Bhumika and in today's video we're going to start with a new topic that is class 8 chapter number 8 chapter's name is La Photo de Manuel. We're going to see the textual exercise of this chapter. Okay, I have already explained the explanation part of this chapter so you can just check it out. Moving to the first question, the first question is complete with demonstrative adjectives. So as we know there are four types of demonstrative adjectives that are sir, say, say and say. So C E sir is used for masculine, okay? And uh, C E T is also used for masculine. That is for this and that. Okay? Now if you see the next one say that is used for feminine okay that is used for feminine that is for again singular that means it is also used for this and that okay this and that if you see the next one say so as you can see an s here that means it's used for plural and uh, these are basically demonstrative so here these and those will come okay we all know that demonstrative adjectives in english okay demonstrative adjectives in english are of three uh, four types like four are there so that are this that those these similarly here also there are four so these two are used for masculine one is used for plural and another one is not used for plural okay next is used uh, ce okay so it's your cet jo hai okay it is used for masculine uh, vowel okay masculine vowel agar hoga so you are going to use cet and if ce uh, will use for masculine without vowel all right so this is the common difference between all of them now let's solve the exercise so il shuas dash kravat so kravat is with an e that means it's your feminine with feminine we use se so that's why we are going to write se pa se shapo now shapo is what shapo is your masculine and if you see carefully there is no vowel sound here okay there is no vowel sound in the with the c so yes we going to use se so that's why sir will come here okay now now here we can see hotel hotel is with an o okay we say it as hotel right we say it as hotel so o will be taken in consideration right and o is a vowel that's why cet will come because o is a vowel nu alo a se restaurant now say again this is a masculine word without a vowel that's why we are putting sir il na ashit pa se creon so creon is with an s that's why we are adding c e s il ashit se stilo so stilo c c e is used for masculine right so isliye masculine ke sath we are using c e tu na emo pa se a a actor ma tu em se actrix okay so actor is masculine and actress is feminine so here there is a vowel so c e t hum laga denge and here there is a feminine feminine ke sath to ek hi lagega to hum c e w t e will add ja va se em for lo now this is a uh, this is masculine okay this is a masculine with vowel as you can see there is a i here that means it's what it's a vowel that's why we gonna use c e t theek hai moving to the next question that me, that is complete with the festivals okay so we have seen some festivals like noel la rua okay of on uh, 14 juliet then pasco okay so these uh, uh, such festivals we have seen so we have to now fill uh, fill them in the blanks okay so let's see first is la van sang the sombrero say So when sang kya hota 25th of December so what is there on 25th of December so it's what it's your christmas so noel is going to be the correct answer here next is on prepare la galet pondon la fer de rua theek hai now rua 
Rua is a festival in which no, uh, you know, say it as King's Festival. Okay, King's Festival and Galat. Galat is a sweet dish. Okay, it is a sweet dish, or you say it as a cake. Okay, prepared on this festive. So Rua. Let's six January. Six January is celebrated as the Rua. Okay, six Jan. Next is Dash Sela Fet Nacional de la France. This is very simple. That is your fourteen Juliet. A first January Sela Jour de la On O Se Silvestre. Okay, so this is also very simple. Now moving to the next question. Question number four. That is choose the odd one out. So Pasca, Noel, Tuesday, Notre Dame, and Mardi Gras. Okay. Now if you see here. You can see that um, Pascha. Pascha is what? Pascha is Easter. Okay. Noel. Noel is what? Noel is Christmas, right? Tuso is what? Tuso is a festival in which we pray for the deaths. Okay, dead people. Okay, we pray for dead people. Okay. And Notre Dame is a monument. right and if you see mardi gras what is mardi gras as i uh, it is called as uh, matlab it is a festival also known as carnaval theek hai so now if you see what's the basic difference we can see here that is this is also a festival this is also a festival right we can see that this is also a festival easter is also a festival christmas is also a festival okay uh tuse is also type of festival which we celebrate notre dame is a monument and carnaval is also a festival so that's very clear that the uh, that the odd one out is here notre dame so first ka odd one out is notre dame moving to the second eth jour la on ivre pronton autom okay so what does eth means wait i'll erase this Okay, let me erase it. Yes. So now, if you see here, um, hmm, if you see here, eth, what is eth? Eth is your summer, right? Summer. Jour on is New Year. Hivre is your winter. Pronto is your autumn. Oh no, spring. Pronto is spring and autumn is autumn. Okay, so here what is the clear difference? We can see that a uh, new year is the odd one out. That's why the correct answer for the second one would be jour de la on. Okay, next is fem cuisine tant sir. cousin okay now fem is what a lady your woman cousin is uh, cousin what is it it is cousin you can say right and ton is your aunt sir is your sister okay ek second this is cousin okay this is for masculine and this is for feminine right so here we can see that these all are a type of your relations right this this but lady is not a type of relation so for the third one the correct answer would be fem okay now this fourth one is going to be a homework and you're going to tell me it in the comment section below okay i will give you a hint it is something related to non veg and veg okay something related to this so you are going to let me know in the comments below so moving to the fifth question that is correct the faults okay so say tablo a grand so say say is used for okay let's write it down so and say is used for masculine singular okay c e t t e set is used for feminine singular c e s is used for plural ठीक है, so now tableau, what is tableau? Tableau is a masculine, but without vowel, so उसके साथ क्या लगना चाहिए? C e लगना चाहिए, 
okay next is se me so a patit okay se me so now se isme m to vowel nahi hota to yahan kya hona chahiye or you know that me so is what me so is a feminine word it's not a masculine word that's why yahan par c e t t e hoga se livra so interesting spelling error right yahan pe kya hoga s e s nahi hoga yahan hoga c